In this video, we're going to talk about the next type of mids, the perpendicular mid. Let's delete that last mid. Mid, and to avoid any overdefining or problem in creating the new perpendicular mid, let's click on that surface. Let's pick two surfaces. Let's pick this the bottom surface. So be make sure that you are selecting the right surface so here we have the surface mate it with this surface but we want it to be perpendicular so here you have that perpendicular relation is done so when you are done click ok to fix it more you can make this edge coincident with that edge so you have SOLIDWORKS automatically selected the coincident because it is logically will be working so when you are done click OK so here you have this perpendicular relation is done so with the distance, you can also add distance. For example, this is perpendicular or this coincident. You can edit it and add some distance to change the place you want. So this is the perpendicular net or relation.